what tips can you give other athletes on their way um, in the wingsuit world or in the wingsuit base world? Well, first, first is like do it for yourself. Like if you if you are doing it for the wrong reason, yeah, you probably you won't survive. Like if you're doing it for views or you are doing it for people to let them know that you are badass or something like that, that's really bad. So first of all, do it for yourself, for your own, you know, like your own satisfaction, you know, like, um, and then be a smart, be, you know, like, if if you are not experienced and you are in an exit point where you find some experienced guys and they are like talking about the wins and uh, talking about that they might go down or not jump like if you jump you are dumb because the if the pros are not jumping why are you gonna jump yeah. so listen to those guys and be smart if you would like to hear the whole story about Carlos, how he lives, what he's doing for work and what he thinks about wingsuiting and wingsuit base and also how he got hurt in a competition and how he had to come over this disappointment and what he is doing to come over this disappointment, then check out the Mental Power Podcast number 11, Winged Man and Woman Don't Need to Be Angels. See you there and talk to you soon. Bye.